Previous generation, Smeaton was far busier than now, and, and over, over the years it, it has changed a lot. Well, we had the hotel, of course, and we had the post office over here with a general store, and the garage was open over there, and Mr. Jervisoni was there. Um, and the bank was closed when we came here, but that was the bank, the National Bank. But it's gone backwards over the years, as you can see. Unfortunately, it'd be probably the answer's probably no. Yeah, that would be a very good idea. I don't think we necessarily need need more shops to bring people back. I think it's other it, it's other facilities and services that I think attract people to an area more. So I think it's more community activities or community facilities. Yes, a garage, a mixed business and a post office. Because there's nothing here for them, love, only farm work. There's nothing for the young people here in work. Some new shops, but the trouble is people have got motor cars these days and it doesn't take much to go to Ballarat and they bypass us. Well, I think the problem with the um, small shops in, in Smeaton, like the butcher and the post office, is that um, when people started to travel to Creswick and Ballarat more back in the 50s, less people bought their food locally, and so the shops weren't selling enough, enough product to cover their costs of operating. Whereas Unigrain markets their products worldwide, so we're not dependent on the local community for sales. Industries working here in Smeaton now have created a lot of employment. The mills used to uh, employ a lot. Didn't bring anyone in there, John. No, no. There no, were no. people who lived here. No, 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 only local. People don't shop in Smeaton, they go to Creswick or Ballarat, don't they? Well, we need some work around the area. Like Mr May's porridge farm up here. That's a great thing for the town. And as with Mr. Toos, up this side of town, they employ quite a lot of local people. And that's what's needed for a small country town to prosper. Most of the others were just itinerant workers, weren't they? Yes. Here, you know? A lot of them in would go uh, potato, shearing, potato shearing, digging shearing. and that sort of thing. And they would ride their bikes to Newell and to dig potatoes. Because there's, there's really good services here, you've got a really good school, um, there's a, a bowling club, um, there's a hotel, there's a really good community hall which, which everyone can use, um, there's a church and so there's lots of other facilities and there's a really strong sense of community in the area so a lot of people just like living here because of the strong sense of community. Why does anyone live here? Because it's where home is I suppose. I've never lived anywhere else and neither have you. We need more people to know that Smeaton exists because it's a great place.